Hi, welcome to ExerciseBay.com. I'm Dave Parisi and I'm here with Vladimir again. We were just talking about the chest and how there is really no difference besides risk, benefit ratio, between a fly and a chest press. Actually, on EMG studies and all of the other studies that I've researched over the last 25 years, a chest press itself in this position is far superior than a fly because of the stress on the glenohumeral joint, trying to maintain congruency and that long lever arm pulling on the shoulder joint. So, I'm gonna show you something that I see in the gym all the time. This is a free motion machine, thanks to Roy Simonson from Cybex years ago, who actually invented this machine out of Colorado. The machine was first called Ground Zero. Uh, God bless 9-11, but they changed the name to Free Motion on 9-11 from Ground Zero. The bottom line, You can see, Vladimir, once you get in there, you can see how wide those pulleys are open. Everybody thinks that you have to open up your pulleys to get a pull, okay? Everything I just said, go through the motion. Look at the starting position. Look where that cable is, how far it is away from the joint and where it pulls. I want you to freeze right there, okay? Now I want you to come out slowly. Now pause. Look what's happening to the shoulder joint. Okay, you're actually getting a little bit of external rotation. He can't maintain position here. His chest is shut off and all the stress is pulling his shoulders backward. Look where the load is coming from. The load is actually coming out of his hand. I really want it to come out at the bottom of the humerus, at his elbow, okay? So I wanna to try to get this load to move in to about here because there's still going to be can you come across with both arms? There's still gonna be a nice pull with the load to move in a little bit and there's gonna be less stress and strain on the shoulder. Look at the difference between the yellow pole and the cable. Okay, there's a huge difference there in the line of pull. We talk about opposition. Okay, so there's a lot of stress. If you're gonna do a fly, let's talk about the safe and most effective way to do it. I'm gonna take the load for you. We're going to move these into about four. I'm going to have Vladimir come back in. Okay, this is just a theory. I want a little bit of an inverted V, okay, slightly. Okay, it has to do with the lateral lip of the bicipial groove where the pec attaches. The pec attaches here, it doesn't attach here under the arm. It has to cross the joint to get motion and movement, so we're gonna do a little bit of inverted V here. Okay, I'm gonna walk forward just a little, right there. Okay, extend out just a little more, Is with the arms only, push out, there you go. Okay, we have a slight bend in the elbow. He's gonna do a medial arc curve, he's gonna come back in a slight curve, and I want you to freeze for a second. As you notice, look at the line of pull now. Okay, look how close it is to the elbow joint. Okay, prior to that, it was way out here. Okay, so that's a lot more stress on the shoulder joint. I want you to go through the motion. You're on that brick wall. We're not gonna go back any further right there. Understand that if he goes back any further, he's starting to pull on the anterior delt. The pec is going to shut off and try to stabilize and maintain congruency in this region as you stress and strain the shoulder girdle. How many times have you done a fly and you get up off the bench or you get up off the cables that are way too wide, you okay? Mm -hmm. And you hold your shoulder. You see it all the time, you hold your shoulder. Uh, it's mostly anterior delt. I wanna put stimulus in the pec region. I'm even gonna limit his range. Just come through, slow, pause, extend. Slow, pause, extend, and release. Good. That's the most safe and effective way it's not what you do, it's how you do it. And just because you could doesn't mean you should. Trust me, the most effective way you can do a PEC cable machine is absolutely in this range of motion. Thanks for watching ExerciseBay.com. I'm Dave Parisi. I'm here with Vladimir. Thank you.